today I'm visiting three adjacent landowners who manage their forests in a collaborative way. They have recently decided to not go the route of conventional clear-cutting management, but instead create a permanent mixed forest that will deliver high-quality timber through a process called CCF. Let's learn all about their collaboration model and why they make these management choices. Enjoy! There's three landowners here adjoining and um, we've been managing this in a collaborative manner since it was first planted. 22 years ago. 22, 23 years ago. The um, natural constraints around here is very late spring frost, so you'd get frost here in June. Hence, there's quite a high proportion of Norway spruce here and roughly 40, 50% broadleaves here. Initially, what made it attractive here was this was challenging, quite challenging land to farm and then there was very attractive forestry incentives in the 90s and we were all part of that. Oh, well, it's more or less a good, um, good forestry land. It's growing fabulously now. It's great soils, very fertile. You still do some farming? Oh, we do, yeah. I'm still at it. Or in the uh, dry stock. I hope to retire shortly, but anyway, I, I carry on, you know, I carry on. Fair play. <laughs> at the moment, you guys go over into a continuous cover, closer to nature kind of management. Yeah. So the main species here is, is Norway spruce. Spruce, huh? Um, so our plan here is, I suppose, to create more mixture in that over time. So over the next 25 years, we want to see that develop into a mixed forest. And then we've, in the broadleaf area, a lot of single ash. species ash. Yeah. And that has been a problem with the ash dieback disease. So uh -huh. we're, we're clearing that ash area at the moment and planting it back in a CCF forestry mix. Currently then, there's two thirds of the place is thinned. Celsius has been thinned at the moment. So it's been thinned by Liam Byrne, mm. who's one of the main contractors driving continuous cover forestry. How we've decided to manage it since has been dictated by a bit of climate change. Just being aware of what's going on around us, that this system here is probably more, way more suited to a continuous cover forestry system. We've just started down that track now in the last two years. And hopefully in 25 years time, when we come back, you won't know the place. So yeah. there's, there, and you can see the, the changes. Yeah, yeah, you can, yeah. And the rivers and the wildlife and yeah. such and such. You think that will also in the long run be beneficial economically for you guys? The new grants that we're seeing in, in, in CCF, we had already decided to go down this road before the CCF grants. So yeah, that, that makes it much more attractive. But the idea that you could clear fell here and start over again in a refar just in terms of the physical control of vegetation, you would have masses of willow, mm. masses of vegetation. You'd, it would require huge chemical inputs. The cost of re reforesting is massive. Reforestation is massive in time. Mm. The, the resource, it's really lending itself to a close to nature approach. The credits are another important part of the... Oh yeah. yeah well, we'll, hopefully there. we'll see carbon credits here and if we can get a payment for ecosystem services. Well, this is the ideal model then. Very quickly, the most important thing for you, why CCF fits so well? Ah, oh, well, look, at is a farmer. So yes. Just, you, you, you know, you don't k kill all your stock in one day either. I oh, know, just over the year. That's the come, as we say. But the animals come. When neighbours are working together, for me, is a, is a great model. We can manage this here because Celsius has machinery here. Use of tractors, use of other farm machinery is a huge help to the whole project of when neighbours just trust one another and there's never been an issue with... Never, no. Everything is very transparent, I suppose. That's the, that's the big thing. And you, uh, like what's to come. Yeah. We're trying to make things more interesting as we go along. What a great example, guys. Thanks so much. Watch the complete series about continuous cover forestry. Click the end screen or playlist link in the description. Also watch my other series with the charity Kelp about native woodland and trees on the farm. Stay tuned and thanks a lot for watching.